So who remembers the first step? Kathleen Murphy's hands have been in the mud for 20 years. Here at her studio at the Shatford Centre in Penticton, she leads pottery and other classes for all ages through the Okanagan School of the Arts, like this group of day campers, many of whom are beginners. You make it look so easy. It's just practice. It's like you're moving it. Okay, so you want to centre the clay so it's not wobbling first. What's the hardest part about the wheel? Uh, you have to shape it. Shape it. Did you help me make that? I love the shape. Does it always turn out to be what you thought you would make? Oh. But I just try. What do you think about doing pottery? I like it. I've always wanted to do it, so this year my mom saw the camp and she signed me up for it. We usually start out with pinch pots, coil pots, slab work, where you roll the clay out with a rolling pin and press the clay into molds to make things. So bang it down with your hand as hard as you can. <laughs> Good. And flip the clay over. And you just roll it out with the rolling pin. You guys are doing good on the wheel. I like that you can always try again. That's kind of looking like a vase now. So tell me about all the things that you made all week. What has everybody made? I made a teapot. You made a I made teapot? A plate. I made a bowl. Everybody's pretty much made a bowl. It's neat for them to have, you know, their little pieces of art or bowls and plates that they can take home and use. Okay, you can go and get a piece of the brown clay. The brown clay just has more iron in it, and that's why it looks kind of reddish brown. I think it's really good for kids. Um, it's great for their motor skills when they're really young. And um, just to be creative and to make things and learn how to build things. I love the kids' classes, the adult classes, being creative with them. Yeah, it takes a little practice, but uh, it's nice for them to at least have the experience of trying it once during camp. Did everybody have a failed experiment? Yes. yes. Uh, Three just, thumbs in to make a hole. I just scared that I'll ruin it. It's okay. If you ruin it, we can try again. Can you squeeze the clay in and try and make it taller? Oops. I think I made it too big. The great thing about clay is that you can try something and if it doesn't work out, you just smush, smush it all back together into a ball and try it again. It's a pretty big accomplishment for them. Once they start with one, like a piece of clay, they make it, it gets fired, it gets painted, and then they have things that they can take home and actually use. And Like this. 